Hey everyone, this is Michael with Mealy Marine, and today we're going to be showing you how to restore your old bass boat. This is part one of a series, and as you can see, this boat is pretty rough. It needs new seats, new carpet, it needs a good old polish, and just a general old cleanup. And we're going to be doing lots of stuff to this boat, so stick around. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. I spent about 30 minutes to an hour trying to get this troll motor foot pedal off and it was only held down by three screws, one of them being a two inch long sheetrock screw. Um, but after a bunch of perseverance, I was able to finally get it off. Okay guys, so here's the front of the boat with the carpet off. As you can see, it's in pretty good shape. We still got quite a bit of work to do here on the front of the boat. We need to remove all the lids uh, and the carpet on those lids. And we also really need to remove that nasty carpet at the bottom of the boat, which is not a lot of fun. So here we go. So a little bit of information about this boat. This is a 1988 Ranger 363V with a Yamaha 150. It's 17 feet, 10 inches long with an 88 inch beam. It's a light featherweight, 1200 pounds. And it is the padded lounge version of this boat, which means up there on the front deck, there's a nice pad for you to sit on and enjoy your time out on the water with your family or friends and uh, I think it's a really cool idea. The carpet's been pretty easy to pull up up to this point except on that one or two lids on the front deck but in the back of the boat here it was a lot harder to pull this carpet up um i don't know if it was just the way that the boat was positioned on the trailer that the water sat on the carpet on the front deck or more traffic or whatever it was um, that caused it to be easier to pull off so it took me quite a bit longer to get the carpet off of this but it was just a little you know, a little bit of effort. It's really easy to pull carpet off these old boats. All I'm using is my hands and a little scraper to kind of get started and just ripping it off. There we go, the end of part one. Um, 
pretty much everything is out of the boat. I like to take all the hardware and put it into plastic baggies so I know where they went. But we got all the carpet out. The bottom of the boat needs a little bit of work, but we're going to get to that later on in the series. We're going to have to build a platform for the seats to go on. And um, as you can see, we got all the carpet out. It's still pretty nasty there. Um, and we got the whole back of the boat done. Those live oils were full of water, so we had to bucket them out by hand. But uh, well, there she is, guys. There's the Ranger 363V Part 1 of the Restoration Series. Be sure to subscribe and like this video if you like the content.